Wouldn't it be great if we had a light that came on to warn us if we were in the early stages of cancer? Through his research, Dr. Ma at the Missouri University of Science and Technology has discovered a way to see that warning inside a small black box. The reason we put it in a black box is because we have a very sensitive detector. We call it in a photomultiply tube. That tube is so sensitive it cannot see the light like this. If you see the light, the very bright light, the detector will be dead right away. So put it in a box so only see the light. What happens is and the, uh, the eight molecules that we are looking at in urine samples, they fluoresce. And you gotta remember, in urine samples, there are millions and millions of molecules. You know, you have to have, that's why we use high voltage. So what happens is, you put a capillary, inject some urine sample, then put it in a buffer, have a high voltage on, say 20, 25 kilovolts. Then the molecules will walk at different speed. So those eight molecules will be separated from others. Then you look at the molecule glow at a specific time. So then you say, ha ha, I see you. Just being able to see the eight cancer markers wasn't enough to make the black box useful. Dr. Ma and his students had to figure out how to interpret the data they were seeing. Some cancer marker, which are called the molecules, and some in the upper level, some in the lower level. So we can only see you know, one of this. And we, it's very hard for us to do a correlation. And my student found out and do a lot of literature search, found out the, those markers in the urine sample can be in, can be in either form. So we finally said we have to bring them to all the, in the same form. So we use, we all oxidize them into the symbol form. The correlation is great. I said, ha ha, that's how that works. I'm eager to bring that technology to the real world to help people to save people's life. I don't know how many people feel great and walk to the hospital, spend a thousand dollars. I want to find out whether I get a cancer or not. But this one, and uh, you spend, well, in the lab, you can spend up 10 bucks, 10 minutes. I will know what's going on. How about that? You cannot beat it.